What's up YouTube? It's me, KK Jinx, here with another Zelda Breath of the Wild tutorial. And without further ado, let's get started. So you start at Brother's Roast. We've already activated this mission. We can look in our stuff here, activate it. It says, Blandon's brother, Gangoran, should have been back by now. It sounds like he went to Gorko Tunnel, southwest of Gorko Lake, to dig up the secret of the hero. So that is what we are going to do. Now we want to go to Gorko Tunnel, which is just south of Gorko Lake. So there's the lake. There's the tunnel. Let's go ahead and mark it. And now where we want to go first is we want to get up on that bridge up there. And of course, as you know, you can go all the way around this way and get up to there. But I'm actually going to come up over here and up to these rocks up there. And I'm just going to climb all the way up there. So however you got here, as long as you're on this side of that bridge, you're good to go. And so right now we are still on the path that the map shows us. And we are going to follow that just for a moment. Until we get up to the hot springs. And now once we get up to the hot springs, then of course if you need heart restore, jump in the water. Uh, but otherwise, we are just going to keep coming around. You can see these planks in the ground. We're going to just follow those around. And we've got these uh, torch things here. This is where we want to go. We want to follow this. It's off map path, but it is still a path. And the enemies that we will encounter through here are not terrible. It's just these two choo-choos. For now. But we're going to come up to another torch with a sign. And we are going to want to stay right. We read the sign. It tells us that way to the Forgotten Gorko Tunnel. So stay right. And you can see the gates down there. Which is the entrance that we want to go into. Now before we go and talk to him, I'm going to come up to this cooking pot and I would like to just make some heart restore food and a defense food and some speed food. Alright, so now we're going to go and talk to him. He's coughing and wheezing, he's tired, he wants to get through the rubble. It's too important, but his belly's too empty. So he came and found him by thinking like him, and he can't stand idly by. He needs to help. So he wants us to exit here, go down the hill to Gortram Cliff, and there we will find rock roast rolling around. And he needs us to go grab one for him. He'd like to do it himself, but he has a chronic condition. Yeah, it's called gore on shoulder. Very serious. I'd rather not talk about it. Alright, so. First thing we want to do is not forget to eat our defense food. Alright, so my defenses are up. And I'm going to come down here to this path. And we've got a sign here that reads Gordon Cliff Ahead. So this is the way we want to go. Now, there are some enemies down here. Um, any way that you can avoid them is what I would do. Um, they're not going to do any good to fight these guys right now because they're not going to be here. Once we update this quest, it's going to be a whole new spawn of... Moblin, you know, Moblin's up there to, to attack us. You'll see as soon as we get down here. Alright, so it's updated. So I'm not even going to grab one quite yet. Watch out for falling rocks. Okay, so the first thing we want to do is... We want to get these guys to notice... That we're here... And to start coming downward. 
Because a bunch of rocks are going to come down. And hopefully smash some of these guys. Um, it looks like not this guy, though. So we're just going to have to fight him real quick. Okay, so now we just got to go do the th same thing to the rest of them. Take them out however you can. Don't let these guys hit you. They have a very strong attack with just the bow. Alright, so that guy, we can ignore him because we can stay to the other side. I just want to watch for falling rocks. But we're going to come back down here and grab our rock roast. And we're going to make our way back up. And I typically like to stay to the left. Once we get closer to the top, it's there's going to be a huge boulder that comes down. And you'll have to get out of the way of it because it will hit you. It will hurt you and you will drop your rock roast and you will have to go chasing back after it. But you just kind of want to follow along these areas because some areas are too steep and he will drop it trying to climb up it. But we've got him over there. As long as we stay over here, we should be fine. And there's the giant rock I was talking about. Let's see if I can get all the way fast enough. I did. And we should be fine for the rest of the way up. There you go, rock roast. <laughs> Deliciously grilled rock roast. You are hallucinating. Full belly, let's do this. <laughs> so this is the secret of the hero, eh? Alright, the first thing I want to do is eat my movement speed food. Alright, let's go do the shrine. This is the Keira Ma Shrine. If you need reminders, we are just south of Gorko Lake inside Gorko Tunnel. This is Greedy Hill. 
We're going to start by going forward up these stairs. And now once we get up here, you can see it's very steep and all of these are going to come rolling down to us. So the first thing we're going to want to do is get in between this fence here because that is what's going to protect us. There's also little spiky ones, so watch out for those. But the other thing, as you can see, they also do let down some goodies. But just keep an eye out. Every time you see them start to roll, just get out of the way. After that ball rolls, we're going to cut over here and get this chest. And then let the next ones fall. And then come over here, let those go, and then come back over here. Alright. And there's going to be a bunch of red rupees coming down here. We want to grab some of those. Watch out for these things. Now once we get up to the top, they are going to stop. Before we go inside, we're going to turn around and we see this chest here. Five bomb arrows. All right, now if we take a look at our map, we see the treasure symbol next to the shrine name, so we know that we have all of the chests, and we can go ahead and check out. And that's where I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up. I had a lot of fun today. I hope you had as much fun as I did. And until next time, be sure to smash that like button. And if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing and punching that bell right in the face with your fist. So you're the first to know when new content is released. Thanks for watching.